Hmm. What is this thing? And what does it have to do with Potato 451? Guess we need to put something in there to get this thing going. It's... empty? Waiting for material request. I mean, it must be talking about the potato, right? Sounds right to me. Uh... potato? Please? Acquiring... potatoes! Items dispensed. Thank you! Wait, two potatoes? Yeah, a normal one and a poisoned one. Which one do we use? I mean, the word of passage didn't say anything about poison. But it did have that weird hashtag thingy. That might mean something. Oh, I don't think that symbol ever actually means anything. Huh. Gotta figure out which one is correct. I hope this is right. I still need to enter the rest of the Word of Passage. Won't know if this is right or not till I do. Sounds like progress, right? Parrot party protocol initiated! Uh... I'm, uh... I'm guessing that's not quite right. Agreed. Sorry, parrots. And there we go. Or a bad thud. It's Fred? Sara, hi. If you're seeing this recording, well, I guess the worst has happened. And you just put the word of passage into the primary terminal. I wish the terminal could just take away Romeo's admin powers. It'd be easier that way. But making this gauntlet was the best I could do. Put your hand into the pedestal to receive the gauntlet. It's got the power to make Romeo normal again. It might take a few hits to remove his powers entirely, but it'll get the job done. Do you understand? Then good luck, Sara. You're... Well, I think you might need it. Here goes nothing. What do you think you're doing? What's happening? We're here to stop you, Romeo. Once and for all. I told you. Your world's done. No take that! Jesse, hurry! What you're playing at. 
But it ends now! now! I said it ends now! What? What? I'm... Um, oh, you, you think you're very clever, don't you? Well, how about we finish this with a little change of scenery? The Sea Temple. Kalu Kalei, Jesse. Remember when we first met? Oh, that was back when I thought we could still be friends. Yeah. Huh. Figures. This temple, this challenge, was my first gift to you. Now, it's going to be where I bury you. Nowhere to run. To you, Admin. No, that's a shame. Here I thought it would be a nice way of working through some things.
Here, I thought it would be a nice way of working through some things. make everything so difficult. Everyone likes you, and you're nothing. Hey, we're not the ones trying to rule the world. What? No, no, I'm not. I just... I just wanted people to... is held together by my powers. No more powers. No more terminal zone. <laughs> We're doomed. We're gonna get buried if we don't get out of here pronto. What about him? 
What about him? He's not our problem anymore. But look at him. He'll never make it out of here on his own. Oh, she's right. Just... just leave me. My power... It was just frosting on a, on a cake. An empty, worthless cake. No, this is where I belong. This is where I'll pay for what I've done. I can't believe that this is what it took for me to realize. Oh, I've been just so stupid, so blind. You can still fix things, Romeo. No matter what you've done, you're still a person, like everyone else. You can be redeemed. Redeemed? You... You really believe that, don't you? Jesse, now's the time. We gotta go. Go on, leave me. I deserve to stay in this oblivion. Come on, this place is falling apart. We can decide what happens to him later. Let's grab him and go, now. You're not staying here. That would be the coward's way out. Come on. If the lava gets to that portal before we do, we'll be stuck here forever. Then let's move. You're in the clear, Slim. Hey, nice work. Sincerely, I hardly believe that I deserve to be here at all anymore. I do know what I need to do to make up for my crimes, though. I'm gonna return to the underneath. Try to help all the people I left behind. Fix all the lives I... ruined. And I'm gonna try and find Zara. See if I can't make things right between us. I mean, it doesn't make up for what I... Or what I did to Fred. But if I can heal things with Zara, well, it's something at least. And, and no more admin powers. Everything I do now will just be the normal way. Hope I can still remember how the normal way even works. That sounds fine, Romeo. But it's only the start. 
You have a lot of making up to do. I know. It's true. Save the world again, huh? Doesn't that ever get old? Why, yes, thank you for noticing. Thought we'd fit in a light bit of world saving before afternoon pie time. Happy to see you all in one piece, too. Whoa, 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 whoa! Is that the admin? Is he- Don't worry. He's not the admin anymore. This is Romeo. Well, that's a relief. No more admins for me, thank you very much. I agree with that 112%, Blondie. But Jesse, after everything he did, do you... Do you really think he deserves to go free? What if he hurts more people? He might... He might have been better off where he was. I know he was terrible. But... I saw him sitting there and... I just couldn't do it. Even if he did deserve it. I just couldn't live with myself if I trapped him there. Well, that's because you're a good person, Jesse. But... I just hope it was the right decision. What do you guys say we head home? I say, way ahead of you, friend. <laughs> Me too. Man, I cannot wait to put on a shirt again. I am approaching you from this direction, and am coming to speak with you. No ninja trickery, hijinks, or tomfoolery here. Both my actions and my intentions are crystal clear. Huh. After all the times you've snuck up on me recently, I appreciate that. Precisely my intention! My days of sneaking up on people are behind me. So, no more... Ninja Ivor, then? Ha! Huh. No, no. I decided it was time to stop running around in my pajamas and start trying to fix a few messes. Starting with trying to heal the rift between my old friends. Ellie will be easy. Just need to stop by Redstonia. Last I heard, Gabriel was doing the wandering warrior thing. Soren? No idea where he is, but I've got some leads. Oh, man, that's awesome! They're gonna be so excited! You think so? That's certainly the way I'm hoping it will happen. Well, I suppose it's time for me to go. This has been fun, though, hasn't it? Jesse! Jesse, hey! What's up, Radar? I was just saying goodbye to. <sighs> Guess ninja habits die hard. I, uh. Hope you don't mind, but uh, I've kind of been taking charge of the beautification project. I thought, why not at least make it look intentional? Really stepping it up to leader mode, if I do say so myself. And it's been stressful, but also fun. So like fun, stressful, S stress fun? Anyway, I think I've been doing a pretty good job. You've definitely been stepping it up. I'm really proud of you. Oh, wow. This is best day. Whoa! Oh, hey, Luna. Anyway, uh, so with Champion City gone, I was going to make Luna a new llama house and get her set up here in Beacon Town while I help out up there. But uh, before I did, I thought I'd uh, double check and see if you'd already been planning on, you know, uh, watching out for her. Seeing, you know, that she likes you so much and all. If you've already built her a llama house when I haven't been around, I, I I just wouldn't want to double up. Which, by the way, I'd be okay with you doing if you'd already built one, or were planning to. I just want to be sure. I can tell you mean a lot to each other. In your own weird ways. 
I wouldn't want to come between that. Yes, yes, that's true. I really am sorry for how I acted, Luna. How I treated you. And I hope that if you'll stay with me, you'll let me prove that I can be better. Oh, Luna, darling. I can't tell you how much this means. Oh. I do want to sincerely thank you, Jesse, for everything. You saw me at my worst, and you still thought I was worth saving. That, well, that makes me want to try to be better at being my best. Hoping I can start by helping clean up this dump. Uh, <clears throat> you know, poor town. <laughs> what can I say? I looked below the surface and saw that you probably weren't the worst all the way down. What was that about Stella being the worst? <sighs> hey, Stella and I were just talking about what a crazy road it's been. Yeah, no kidding. Yes, well, we need to be running. Oh, and thank you again for everything. Now, you got everything you need, all packed and double-checked? Yes, Jack. This is very, you know, bittersweet for me, you know. Goodbyes are no good. <laughs> that we have, Nermi. So, I won't say it this time. <laughs> Not to people that I will see again. <laughs> you got it. Come on, walk me to the gate. So, you're leaving, apparently? For how long? Honestly, probably a while. But, it's good this time. I'm doing it for me. I'm trying to, like, grow, or whatever. Anyway, I'm about to say goodbye to everyone, and I- ah! I'm here. I promised myself I wouldn't cry. Promise oh, broken. Oh, jeez. It'll be okay. So Petra's heading off into the Great Unknown, huh? <laughs> I figured. Definitely sounds exciting. Could start a new town, find temples or dungeons or whatever you hack and slash types do. I bet Petra would extend the invite. You could go too. I appreciate that, but I think it's time I settled down here. I just got the ocelots back together. Thought maybe I'd work on a new book. Hey! You guys are missing out on prime group hug action. Ah! No air! Actually die! Ah. <sighs> you don't think this is like the last time we'll all be together, do you? No. Well, maybe. I don't know. I mean, if Petra's leaving... No, hang on. Let's not put all the pressure on me here. Maybe I'll go on an adventure, too. You totally could, man. There's nothing stopping you. Even if it is, no matter what, we'll always be best friends. And I know that you'll all be the best friends I ever had. <laughs> okay. Well, I'm gonna get out of here before I... <laughs> too late. Bye, guys. Be safe out there. Okay. The safest. And when you finish that book of yours, I better have a great part in it. Uh-huh. <laughs> Back in the admin's cabin, I, I know you promised that we'd always stick together. But the invite's still open if you want it. No pressure. Wait. You're leaving? Yeah, I think Petra and I are gonna hit the road for a while. <gasps> Sounds pretty awesome, right? Yeah, yeah, I mean, I mean it does, but, but without you here, who will run Beacon Town? 
Things are peaceful now, but danger could still strike at any time. Uh, the people could, uh, they could revolt or something. Who do you think, pal? You. Me? Really? Yeah. I hereby promote you from intern to hero in residence. Thanks, boss. This, uh, you have been, you are. What I'm trying to say is that I promise I'll make you proud. You already have. Everyone's going to miss you, you know? And I'm going to miss them, too. But if anyone ever really needs me, I'll be around. you'd be interested in a race. 